Hi boys and girls, welcome to our very first assembly for term three. And can you believe it? We're back into remote learning. All the teachers and staff here are really missing you all and can't wait for you to be back at school. I know this week lots of teachers have been joining you with Zoom um, conversations this week, Zoom meetings, so that's been wonderful. And I've been able to um, look at some of those Zoom meetings and be in some of them. It's been great to see you. And, and just to hear your voices has been really, really nice. So well done, boys and girls. Congratulations on joining in those Zoom meetings so well. And for just, um, you know, adhering to our Zoom meeting protocols and doing such a great job of being respectful, responsible and safe in those Zooms. Boys and girls, we've got our very first assembly for the term today. And you'll be able to watch this. And um, at today's assembly, we're going to also hand out our end of term two awards. And that's because we weren't able to do it at the end of last term. You will have received those in your learning packs uh, last week, but we're gonna read out your names today, just so that you can be acknowledged today as well. So I'll hand over now to our year six students who are gonna lead us in our prayer, our PB4L jingle. And also they have some other messages and reminders for you. Welcome everyone to our remote learning assembly. We hope you've been enjoying remote learning and it isn't too tough. We know lockdown can be hard, but hopefully it ends soon and we all get to see you. Hello St. Joseph's. Make sure you're finishing all your work at home and staying on top of your learning in this difficult time. Now let's pray the school prayer together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord. Bless this day for me and all of us. Make it a day in which we grow a little more like your son and gentle as Mary, his mother. St. Joseph, pray for us. St. Mary of the Cross, MacKillop, pray for us. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, please help the people in the nursing homes deal with lockdown because they can't see any of their family. We also need to keep the people who are less fortunate in our prayers and help your family as much as you can.
Okay, it's time now for our end of term awards from term two. And as I said before, we weren't able to hand them out at the end of last term, so we're going to do it today. So boys and girls, your award is in your learning pack. So if you've got your award with you in your learning pack, why don't you go and gra grab it so we can celebrate you now. Okay, so for our Academic Achievement Awards, Charlotte Radzeminski for Literacy. Well done, Charlotte. Xavier Servanaro for Literacy and Numeracy. Archer Turner for Mathematics. Jimmy Ryan for Literacy and Numeracy. Great job, Jimmy. Brooke Carfield, Mathematics. James Bennett for Literacy and Numeracy. Leo Seagrave for History. Emily Ayres for Numeracy. Daniel Wiley for Literacy. Finn Peterson for Writing. William Ma for Literacy. Viviana Aguilera for Creative Arts. Well done, Vivi. Ruben Darmi for Literacy and Numeracy. And Emily Benefiel for History and Science. So well done to those students. Let's give them a big Fantastico. Ready? One, two, three. Fantastico! Great job, everyone. Now don't forget that those awards are not necessarily for the best student or the highest student in the class. They're for students who've had a lot of learning gain and done a great job. So well done to those students. Remember to be respectful, responsible and safe while doing home learning. Now let's do our jingle together. Three, two, one. Come on, Joey's. You can do it. Just put a little effort to it. Be respectful, be responsible, be safe. Be respectful, be responsible, be safe. Good job. Hey, it's time now for our Habits of Mind Award. So congratulations to these wonderful students. Arlo Brown for remaining open, open to continuous learning. May Flood for thinking flexibly. Rain Wright for remaining open to continuous learning. Great job, Rain. Zane Norrie for being open to continuous learning. Isabella Lyon for remaining open to continuous learning. Ashton Barnes for remaining open to continuous learning. Harry Sterling for persisting. Well done, Harry. Sadie Jones for responding with wonderment and awe. That's great, Sadie. Zoe Ransley for remaining open to continuous learning. Evan Stavro for remaining open to continuous learning. Pippa Seagrave for remaining open to continuous learning. Hayden Isles for remaining open to continuous learning. And Charlie Lupiti for persisting and striving for accuracy. And Neve Miranda for striving for accuracy. Well done those students, great job. Let's give them a big round of applause. Hi everyone, I hope you're having a great time during home learning. I've heard that you've all been doing amazing. Keep it up. Remember, remember to keep active, have fun and keep going. We've got this. Go Joeys! Okay, students of St. Joseph's, it's time now for our St. Mary MacKillop Awards for Term 2. So congratulations to these wonderful students. In kindergarten, Yuna Lapinid and Mahalia Stavro. In year one, Evie Stinitso and Hamish Barlow. In year two, Emma, ha uh, sorry, Emma Hogan and Hartley Brown. In year three, Carter O'Loughlin and Zane Beef. In year four, Javier Aguilera and Charlotte Liplin. In year five, Tessa Hawkins and William Murray. In year six, uh, it was Lachlan Choice and Matthew Reckles. So well done to those students. Make sure during lockdown, you're keeping active. Make sure you have heaps of breaks during your learning.
Okay, I'm back again, and it's time now for our Principals Awards. So these weren't handed out at last assembly either, but they were in your home learning packs as well. So here we go. So in year one, uh, Indiana, Evie, and Georgia received a Principals Award. In year two, Isabella, Lani, Kirby, Genevieve, and Harry received a Principals Award. In year three, it was Oliver, Zafi, Jacob, Ava, and Annie. In year four, Evan, Poppy, Amelia. In year five, Dylan, William, and Kim. And in year six, Sam, Abigail, and um, Xavier. So well done to those students. Fantastic job to get a principal's award. Well done. Hi everyone. Good job on all your home learning achievements. I hope everyone is staying fit, but still eating some lollies. So go gold, woo! Hi everyone. You all have done a good job with remote learning. Keep up the good work. Hi everyone. Make sure you have lots of breaks in home learning so you always have a fresh brain. Go green. Hey everyone. Keep up the good work during home learning and stay active. Go blue. Hi guys, hope home learning is going well for you and you are having fun. We just need to give it our best and keep persisting. Go Blue! So, a stuck at home. What can you do? Be an environmental hero. One way you can do this is by helping with composting and continuing with your recycling. So while you're out here, why not order your garden? Now we go in and give it a trim. After we've given it a water, this will allow to give it a chance to grow between seven to 10 days. Mm. We're relying on you, environmental heroes. Also remember to save electricity. Bye. Remember to get out, get some sunlight and take care of your environment. Hello boys and girls, mums and dads. We've reached the end of the second week of remote learning. Some of you have been working from home really, really hard with the help of mum and dad. And some of you have been coming into school during these last two weeks. Let's have a look at the wonderful work some of our students have been doing these last two weeks during remote learning. Wake up and the sun is shining on me, it's a brand new day. Feels like something good's gonna come our way. Reminisce on God's blessing, confessing how I'm so amazed. I've got a heart full of joy that I can't contain. I'm filled with hope today. What more can I say? I wanna celebrate and lift my hands and give praise. What happened? I'm clapping, they static dancing and rapping. We want the world to embrace it, let's face it. Cause you make me happy that moment. You feel that happiness is for you. You make me happy, happy that moment. Yeah. 
Okay, boys and girls, that's it for our assembly for week two. So I hope you've had a great week of learning this week and next week as well. Make sure you're doing a fantastic job again. I know your teachers are incredibly proud of you. Mums and dads, if you're watching our assembly today, make sure to take care of yourselves. Just do the best you can with your students in home learning. And remember, teachers are available to help out. So please make sure that you contact the school if you need any help at all. No question is too silly. We really want to help you out. Boys and girls, have a wonderful weekend and we'll see you at next week's assembly. Bye.